Our theme is Samuel. For this theme, yeah, yeah. you will need the following items. A blanket or bath towel. A dust rag or washcloth. Wooden sticks, some you may have collected on a nature walk or right outside your front yard. A basket. Pretend bread or real bread. Small plate. Flashlight. And a robe. Oh, and don't forget a small broom. The Bible tells us the story of a little boy who was God's little helper. His name was Samuel. He helped at church and at home. Little Samuel lived in a tabernacle with priest Eli. Little Samuel was Eli's helper. Little Samuel was God's helper. And every year, Samuel's mother made him a nice robe to wear as he helped in the tabernacle. Let's dress up in a robe like Samuel so we can be ready to help as Samuel helped priest Eli. Let's sing about being Jesus' helpers while we dress up like Samuel. Jesus helper doing all he can. Samuel was a helper, tiny though was he. Who is Jesus helper doing all he can? Samuel was a helper, tiny though he was. Y'all have our rows on? Yes. Yep. yep. Perfect. Little Samuel was helping the Lord. Little Samuel helped make up his bed in the tabernacle. Can you roll up your bed like Samuel did? Let's sing as we roll up our beds. Let's roll up our beds. with our wood sticks. 
was a Would you pretend to be Eli? Me on the mat. Shh. Let's be quiet now. Eli is sleeping. Uh, it's time for Samuel to go to bed. Come here. It's time for Samuel to go to bed. You all, you all pretend to be Samuel. Here. Sorry. Right. Um, Okay, come lay down. It's time for you to go to bed. Kari. You go lay over there and pretend to be saying okay. Say, excuse me. Yeah. Lay down. Okay. Go to bed. While Samuel was sleeping, he heard someone call him. Samuel. Samuel. Samuel got up fast and ran to Eli. Get up, get up, get up and see. See what Eli wants. So let's let's go like Samuel. Samuel said, here I am. May I help you? Let's ask Eli. Here I am, Eli. May I help you? Say it. Here I am. May I help you? I call you. Go back to sleep. Eli said he didn't call you. Go back to sleep. Let's go back to sleep. Lay down. Let's go back to sleep. Now, Samuel is sleeping again, but he hears someone call him. Samuel. Samuel. Jump up. Hold on. Let's go to Eli and say, did he call us? Did we, didn't you hear that? 
See, Eli, did you call me? Eli, did you I call didn't me? call you to go back to sleep. Eli said he didn't call us to go back to sleep. So let's go back to sleep. And then, what do you hear? Samuel. Samuel. Did you hear that? Let's go see what, if Eli and see what he needs. Eli. Eli. Say, Eli, did you call me? Eli, did you call me? No. The next time you hear a voice say, here I am, boy. I am your son. So let's go back to sleep. So Eli said, the next time we hear a voice to say, speak, Lord, your servant is listening. Samuel did as Eli said. And when God spoke to little Samuel, Samuel listened. He listened carefully. God gave Samuel a special message for Prince Eli. That was the first message of many that God gave to Samuel. And Samuel became God's helper for the rest of his life. A very good way to be God's helper at home is by listening and being obedient. Listen carefully when your mommy or daddy calls you. Go to them quickly. Samuel was 
helping the Lord. He was God's little helper. He helped in church and at home. You are God's little helper. You can help at church and at home. Mom. Let's sing. Mm -hmm. Okay, come on. Let's sing. Come here. Come sing with me. Jesus helper, doing all he can. I am Jesus helper, tiny though I am. Jesus helper, doing all he can. I am Jesus helper, tiny though I am. I had a great time in Sabbath school today. And I hope you did too. Did you have a great time? How about you? Did you have a good time? Yes. Good. Let us pray. Dear God, we love you so much. And we we be your helpers every day. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Sabbath school.